hey, what are you doing? Sometimes I make uh, small mistakes or just get these, like these great ideas, like at the wrong time. They're small, but it's like, oh, this is definitely what I want to do. Like on a, uh, on a hot day, like a really hot day. Like I'm, it's really hot, it's humid, I'm sweating. I'm like, oh, I should cut all this off because fuck me. So I'm going to go out and I'm going to get some cold beer to drink and then maybe a snack and I'll look around for my snack because I already have my beer. So I'll look for my snack and I'll be like, Oh my god, I haven't had these in forever. Flaming Hot Cheetos? That sounds amazing. I'm going to eat those and then I go back and I'm still sweating and my mouth is on fire. My beer is getting warm and you know what? I feel like going in a hot tub. That sounds great. A hot tub right now maybe? Doesn't really make sense. And then on a cold day, like like a really cold day, like I'm shivering, I'm shaking, I can't get warm. My nipples are freezing and I think they're going to fall off. There's frozen icicles under my mustache because my nose is leaking and it's freezing at the same time. It's very cold, so I go out and get beer. You always get beer, no matter what. So, it's, so I have my beer and I want a snack and for some reason I want some fucking ice cream. And then when I'm eating my ice cream, I think maybe I'll go for a swim. Take the polar bear plunge. That's the thing, right? For a charity or something. Or um, I'll go to, uh, I'll decide, like, I, I, I want to go to a library. There's lots of stuff there, lots of books. And then I'll go there and realize I could find this all on the internet and I hate reading. Or maybe um, I'll get hungry and then I'll be like, you know what? Today's the day. Today's the day I finally like sushi. That's right, I do. And then I get it and then I put it in my mouth and like, no, today's not that day either. I don't know why I thought it was that day. I don't know why I keep thinking I'm going to acquire the taste for it if I keep shoving it in my mouth. Somehow I think I should. It'll make me seem more fancy or sophisticated. And I, I think I kind of want that or need that. Like sushi? Yeah, of course I eat sushi. Do you see these fucking glasses? Yeah. <laughs> Smart person. Or... I go out shopping to that place to get real food, and I think, you know what? Today's the day that I'm finally going to talk to that girl at the checkout register. I will, because I wait in her line on purpose sometimes, even if the other lines are shorter. And then I get up there, and yeah, I don't do that. Today's not that day either. And then I sit um, at home, maybe, very bored. I mean, what am I going to do right now? I have it. I'm going to get addicted to some sort of online PC video game like that. It was um, WoW or League of Legends. And then I'll start playing just to realize, like, yeah, this is kind of fun at first, but I don't know how the fuck I'm going to dedicate, like, an entire year of my life to getting fat and drinking Mountain Dew and playing this. I just, I don't have that kind of energy. And after a couple of days, I'm, I'm over it. I'm just over it. I'm over it. Or maybe um, I need to make it big. I don't want a real job. I'll just uh, I'll write a book. That's what I can do. I can write a book. You know, books are dumb. I'm write a movie, some sort of screenplay. You know what? I fucking love TV shows. I'll just write a TV show. It's, it's money, right there. How could I? You know, seven seasons. It's a lot of writing. Especially if every season has like 20 episodes, maybe only 13. I don't know. You know what? Let's go down to my own, own level. Let's do a comic book. I like to draw. I'll do a comic book. I do like to draw. Maybe I'll host an art show. You know what? No comic book sounds easier. Like, you know, a strip. Like in a newspaper. You know what? Go single page. Single page. You know what? Fuck all of that. I'll be a tattoo artist. That's what I'll do. Because lots of people tell me, Frank, you're pretty good at this. You should stop wasting your talent and just do the damn thing. You know what, tattoo artist? That's not going to work because I hate people and their opinions. Stop wasting your talent? Why is it a waste? They think it's a waste because I don't make money off. You're not making money off this and you're not the best, so, I mean, what are you doing? Stop it. You should just, you should just give up now. It's what you should do. It's basically what they tell me. And uh, then 
I decided to go hang out with some friends, but it was a terrible idea because I hate them. A couple. It's like a dude and a chick. Like a married couple or just like lifetime boyfriend, girlfriend. And I hate hanging out with them mostly because they hate each other and they dedicate most of their time to just being mean to one another. Like the type of people, it's been a while and they're like, come out to the bar with us. And we're like, okay, and I'm there for five minutes. I'm like, wow, I remember why I stopped doing this. Like right away I remember why. Right away. Definitely people you don't want to take a road trip with. Like, we're going to Cedar Point. You want to come? No, because I don't want to spend that much time in the car with you while we drive for an hour and a half. You don't want to do that. You people suck. But then, at the same time, I kind of admire them and their passion and their rage and their motivation to just hate one each To hate each other with such, just, so much going on there. How do you muster up that much motivation? I'm in awe and wish I had or could care about something as much as they hate each other. One guy's like, she's cheating on me. That fucking bitch. I'm like, how do you know? It's like, how do I know? I'm like, yeah, how do I know? How do you know? How do you know? Like, well, I'll tell you what I did. I went in and I read all her emails. Read all her emails. Yeah, there's like 126 emails. I read every single one of those motherfuckers. Like, this bitch... Whoa, dude, 126, that's just, that's fucking insane. If that were me, I mean, she's cheating on me. I'm going to check her emails. After the first one, halfway through, I'd be like, I forgive her. Fuck it, I'm not reading all these. This is too much work. So, basically, Frank, what you're saying is you're just a really lazy-ass motherfucker. Yeah, I, I guess so. I, I guess that's, that's really what I've come to as the conclusion. Well, that's good, Frank. We finally make some, some sort of breakthrough. And being able to admit that to yourself is really the first step in a long line of other crap. Whatever. But yeah, I'll accept that. So. You go do what feels right. And I'm going to go do what feels right. Whatever that may be.